In this video, we're going to talk about how to multiply three digit numbers. So here we have 347 times 256. And the process we're going to use is we're going to start with the 6, and first multiply it by the 7, then multiply by the 4, then multiply by the 3. And then we're going to move to the 5 and do the same process. Multiply by the 7, then multiply by the 4, and then multiply by the 3. Then we're going to go with the 2 and do the same thing. Multiply by the 7, and the 4, and then the 3. All right, so let's start. So we're going to start with 6. 6 times 7 is 42. Okay, I'm going to put down the 2 here and carry the 4 from the 42. Okay. Then we'll apply the 6 times the 4 is 24 plus the 4 that we carried is 28. I'm going to write down the 8 and carry the 2. So you see how we put down the 1's digit and carried the 10's digit over. Okay. Now we take the 6, multiply by the 3. 6 times 3 is 18, plus the 2 that we carried is just 20. Then we need to get rid of what we carried so we won't distinctly use that later. Now when we move to another row here at the bottom, we need to add a placeholder. Okay, each time we go down another row, we're going to add another placeholder. So we went down 1, so we're going to add 1 placeholder. We're putting 0 for it. All right, now we're going to start at the 5, we do 5 times 7, so 5 times 7 is 35, so put down the 1's digit, 5, carry to 3, okay, that was 35, now we do 5 times 4, which was 20, plus the 3 that we carried, so 23, put down the 3 here, carry over the 2, now we do 5 times 3, which is 15, Plus the 2 that we carry gives us 17. So we're down 17. All right, then we can get rid of what we carried over, so we won't mistakenly use that the next time. All right, now we're at the, our third row here. So again, like I said, we need to add another placeholder, so we can add 2 this time. And then we start with the 2, multiply by the 7. 2 times 7 is 14, put down the 4, carry the 1, 2 times 4 is 8, plus the 1 that we carried is 9, 2 times 3 is 6, alright, now from here we're going to add the columns up, so we can do 2 plus 0 plus 0, which is 2, we do 8 plus 5 plus 0 is 13. Put down the 3, carry the 1. And then we have 1 plus 0 plus 3 plus 4. That's going to give us 8. And then we do 2 plus 7 plus 9. It's going to be 9 plus 9 or 18. Put down the 8, carry the 1. We're going to do 1 plus 1 plus 6, which gives us 8. So the answer is 88,832. And that's how you multiply three-digit numbers.